Right. I would rather eat it right now because I'm yeah. absolutely starving. Yeah, but, but... you'll get super fat. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, the guy I, sucks. I'd rather be fat right they now. They do not have... Going to the beach quite early in the morning before we head out of Panama City Beach so we figured this is one of the best beaches we've been to so far so we wanted to take a little extra time at the beach before we have to leave <laughs> So today it is travel day. We are moving spots again. So we left Panama City Beach, which, what was your favorite part about Panama City Beach? The water park. Oh, uh, water park. Wait, no, the beach. The beach is my favorite. Water yeah. park. Okay, so I think we have a tie. The water park. The weather and the beach was amazing at Panama City Beach, so we had a great time there. But again, we have to keep moving. So. We are already into Alabama. We are have left Florida. We're in Alabama and we are going a little bit more rustic camping this time. The last RV park had a pool. It had a you know, room that had games and books. This one, we're going back to the woods and we're gonna go canoeing this weekend. Look at that face. Well, canoeing is okay, yeah. but not the woods. Yes. I wanna do fishing. Well, we might look Too into fishing. Books. Um, we're going on a river. We're gonna go canoeing, so much more rustic than the past place. So we well, will. Canoeing sounds fun. Yeah, canoeing and. I want my own. You got your own canoe. Mm -hmm. All right, all right. So we are going to keep. We will see you at the campground. See you there. Bye. All right. So we made a crucial mistake. We entered the Bible Belt without getting food first. And uh, all we see on any of the maps is church after church after church, but uh, no places to stop for food. Good news, on the good news though, we have enough gas. So that's a good, that's a good thing because there's no gas stations either. Right, so. so hopefully a church could feed us because it's getting, it's getting late. Yes. And we're about to cross the Alabama-Mississippi border. Yes. And even looking farther ahead, it seems like there's only churches. So maybe they'll have a pancake breakfast or something for us. Yeah, maybe like a gym pancake breakfast. I don't know. Because there's like not that. a fast food. There is literally no food. We just got to swing by like a Catholic school and hope they're doing some kind of fundraiser in the middle of the summer. You know, something we're like that. we starving. So, it is 4.30 oh. and we haven't eaten lunch. Now. Now we're in Mississippi. She is upset that we have no cell service. It's extended and it won't let me watch any of my shows. I can't go on Instagram. She's trying to watch show She really is roughing it. I mean, seriously. She is, she's a country girl at heart right now. Whatever. She loves Whatever. country. <laughs> he yeah. just wants to find some barbecue. She's country, country I just want to eat. I don't care what I eat. So there's a barbecue place coming up, but it has funnel cake fries. What do you think those are? I think those are probably french fries that have like a nice donut type coating around them, <laughs> deep fried. They sound super good, I wanna go there. Yeah, they do sound super good. Kind of like 600 calories per fry, Yeah. kind of good. Okay, we did have a McDonald's ah, sighting sure. yes. um, about an hour ago, but they said they would rather starve. See, look. Welcome to Mississippi. Mississippi River. Okay. Oh, it's one Mississippi, yeah, wait. Wait, three, one, three, two. two. Children at play. Oh boy, Holly. This is fantastic. Oh boy. Oh boy, honey. Even Gracie's worried. Yeah, Gracie's like, don't leave me. Right by the railroad tracks. Oh, hi! Tell me when we're eating. How are the bugs out there? Horrible. 
You've never seen city kids until you put them in the country and all of a sudden there's bugs. There's... No one likes bugs. They're gnats and they bite you. And, I... then, you, and then you have a mosquito bite. You don't like bugs too. I agree. I don't like bugs. But you guys get outside and you act like you've never been to the country. Savannah already had something over their fire. <laughs> Was there something over there? Kind of. <laughs> okay, so... It's been a long day. It's already 6.30 at night, and we haven't eaten lunch, let alone dinner. We have very we crappy kids. We ran out of snacks, too. We ran out of snacks. We ate everything that we have in this car. We just never passed a restaurant that we could get out with the dog. It just it, it spiraled out of the control. No, one, we had we, we had a chance to get out with the dog, but we didn't get out. Like McDonald's. Yeah. But what McDonald's. happens with McDonald's, Sawyer? Yeah. Oh. So he doesn't like McDonald's, so we can't ever go there. Right. I would rather eat it right now because I'm yeah. absolutely starving. Yeah, but, but. you'll get super fat. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, I, I'd rather be fat right they now. Do not I'm have, starving. Okay, they make um, their chicken tenders. They're not fresh baked, and they don't kill chicken to do it. They make them with paste. What? Is this SpongeBob? Disgusting. That's a sponge on okay. it, sir. So, no, okay, so McDonald's makes you fat, according to him. So we are going, we're on the road, and we're going to find something to eat. We also, there was a Moe's. That's not called McDonald's. There was a Moe's, Moe's that didn't exist. On the map, it said Moe's, exist. our favorite restaurant. We went out of our way to get there. It didn't exist. We should have mm -hmm. known. In rural Mississippi, there was no Moe's. So now no we Moe's. are going to find dinner, lunch, and everything, and to go to a grocery store. But at least we unhooked the trailer. Wait, wait, never know. You say? Be careful going into Meridian. Which way are we going? We're going to go to the left. So we got warned by the locals not to about going into the local town. This is going to be scary. They're already not sure about this whole rural Mississippi thing. Um, I'm telling you right now, we might be coming back, hooking back up and rolling. <laughs> That's a city boy talking right there. So we just talked about going to eat and also it was like, there's bugs. <laughs> found a great pizza place and they are letting the kids play with little pizza dough. Everything is made fresh here and so we're excited. We got a calzone and pizza. I'm excited about this place. It's called Nick and Al in Meridian, Mississippi. They have New York style pizza and we're hoping it's amazing but the kids are pretty occupied. Every two days seems like we go to Walmart and so this is our new stop at Walmart because we're at a new yeah. place. There's a train that goes through this campground and which we hoped it was only during the regular days or like during the regular hours. It's like 11.15 at night. It's 11.20 at night. 11.20 at night and it's like shakes the whole camper. That would be awesome. Yeah, we're right in the middle of the night. If only we could have it at 3 a.m. That would be amazing. Oh. That would be so good. So she's still up, and because why the train just came by, like a huge. What are those cargo trains? What are they called? Yeah, I mean it's basically a already been working three days. What's called a train? One of those trains that have graffiti on the side. Cargo. It's yeah, it's cargo holders. Yeah, it's sweet. No wonder this place is nineteen dollars a night. It is. This is rustic camping with. We might not be here tomorrow. We might be moving tomorrow. I think I can think we'll make it one more night. I think we make it north one more night. We'll see. There's another train. 